Hi, welcome to my new video presenting my special PHP command line shell class using end courses. It's uh, very long to say, I know. Uh, the idea comes from uh, I need I needed to have a um, SQL server uh, console uh, client under uh, Linux, and I uh, came first with stuff like that. Yeah. And uh, it just basically uh, taking the standard input with fget and uh, dealing with it uh, when you type enter and you can exit. It works not too bad. Um, if I use a database. And I take some stuff. It works. But uh, I have no command line history. Uh, as you can see, when I type with arrow, I have problem with terminal escape code. And uh, as I am typing a query, uh, I don't have auto completion. And uh, if I want to go in the middle of my uh, writing line, it's not possible. So I can just delete the last character. Uh, so it's very uncomfortable. Uh, so I tried to find another thing uh, that is uh, done with uh, NCURS. Uh, but uh, nothing was done with, with NCURS and PHP. It, uh, it's very uh, rare. And I tried to see um, uh, Zen Framework console, uh, Symfony, and uh, it's not real, real console. It's just uh, like the same uh, stuff. Uh, it's trim get line basically on uh, standard input. So I, I have a very big problem. I, I cannot work uh, where uh, as I want. So I try uh, to use NCURS to to write uh, a console class classes, and uh, I uh, I felt like I, I reinvent a little the wheel, but I was pretty uh, happy with it. Uh, I have a lot of problem uh, for um, for uh, inserting character, deleting character. Uh, uh, as you can see, very dirty stuff uh, because NCURS uh, makes the work just on one line. For the other line, uh, you have to do it yourself, etc., uh, etc. Et an item for deleting stuff, as you can see, very, uh, very uh, quick pick code, but uh, solving a lot of uh, little problem. So I will show you uh, the stuff with uh, 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 some uh, SQL server and the, the stuff is here you, you require uh, KMD and you extend it and uh, you have three things basically you have your uh, prompt uh, that you can uh, dynamically uh, um, uh, set uh, every time uh, a command is uh, entered or a command is uh, need to be auto completed, it called this function. Uh, you can uh, make a table of uh, tabs uh, for the auto completion stuff, and you can do it dynamically. It uh, you have your command line, and you have what is before the cursor and after, and uh, after you can do uh, every little stuff uh, you want. And uh, so you can do very clever auto completion. And after you have uh, the return, it's a uh, when your line is uh, validated. And here you can do uh, every stuff you want. Uh, you have just to return text output. So it's the most simple uh, way I can offer you to have um, uh, a console uh, that you can extend. And here, so I create my classes. Uh, and you will see these two files, uh, the one 
the sec this one contain uh, every command history and this one will contain uh, everything we have done so let's go for the thing that I cannot show you the password because it's secret so I just uh, launch it with uh, uh, with uh, this stuff but it's basically a uh, server login password uh, argument so as you can see uh, I am on a CRM server uh, but I didn't choose my databases I will not show you the databases because uh, it's a little confidential here I know now that I'm on a databases at a server and if I type my query you can see that I can com auto complete uh, this one so it's more comfortable and as I will validate it I done a, a special text format uh, I can call history back and it's very comfortable I, I have auto completion on uh, on um, field and you can see it's uh, it's perfect so uh, tabulation auto completion history and all what we have done uh, you will see it uh, in these two files so my first file we have type 3 uh, query and the second file which is what uh, we have uh, you can um, uh, if I come back if I come back I will uh, find uh, the exact state I have and I can do page up page down to go up uh, as I were in text file so it's very uh, practical here it's uh, the stuff but I realize, uh, no, it will not work. I realize that uh, as I have uh, separated the console stuff and the SQL server stuff, it's uh, possible to do other things. Uh, for example, it's possible to do uh, to do a PHP interactive shell shell by yourself. Uh, here I just uh, use uh, no to, uh, no to completion, no special invite. It's just a very uh, rapid code to show you uh, the, the possibilities. So like uh, the other thing, I do uh, two stuff: uh, a story and uh, and uh, the log. And you will see it's uh, it's pretty close to. Uh, to PHP tier A, but uh, um, here I I just have to do that. And when I close my bracket, bam, I have uh, the result of my um, of my uh, code that is uh, between uh, special PHP uh, command. So uh, when I uh, kit. Uh, I can do other stuff with history uh, I can do uh, dirty stuff like uh, I will do stupid stuff I don't know uh, it's for a, it can be for educational uh, purpose right so and as you will see uh, I have the script only in one file that is ready to be uh, executed and I have uh, the full stuff um, in another file and it can be executed so it's uh, with a little uh, very little code uh, you can do a lot of, uh, of things and uh, you can uh, use uh, a shell exec from PHP 
So here it's uh, basically uh, a sort of override of Linux console uh, and it will do exactly the same stuff. If I do that, I have the same invite line but I'm not under our Linux console, I am under my console. And as you can see it reacts exactly the same way and what is funny is uh, if you want to do a joke to a Linux administrator you just have to write some uh, creepy code here so I let you uh, imagine uh, what you can do <laughs> 